So we're out here with the Tavor once again, still testing out the 9mm conversion kit here. We have the uh, Vortex Strike Fighter on this one. We're running some PMC Bronze. And so far this thing's been flawless, but uh, it's just uh, been a pleasure to shoot. So let's go ahead, throw some more lead down range here. Sight keeps turning off on me. <laughs> Change the batteries. And that's just fun, quick, smooth shooting. It's pretty nice. Have to wait for the battery. We need to change the battery in this thing. Either that or I'm going to have to send it back to him. Like right now I'm shooting with no battery. By the way, we're also running this uh, T-Rex from Homeland Guns on the front of this. You guys just watched the video on that recently. So just like running the 5.56 version, it just runs. These things just work. If you haven't shot one, I recommend you get out, get some trigger time on one of these. Fantastic system. Feel that echo? Yeah. <laughs> it's running good. Spot on. Good shooting there, Greg. Thank you, sir. Let it rip there, Greg. Give these guys a little sneak peek. They don't know what's coming here. Val Holler. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll explain that later. Here it comes.
100 percent you want to throw some through it sure That was no sight at all. It's point shooting. Just point shooting. That's how low recoil it is. Yeah, a lot of a lot of the rounds I was shooting. Yeah. Uh, the sight was completely off. Yeah. And I was still ringing the target, and that's why. Yeah. The recoil impulse is just nothing. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's easy to keep on target. That's for sure. You want to pull that sight off, Gary? We can pop no. that off real quick. No, we're good. Okay. Nothing going on but the rent, man. That's right. Uh, yeah, there's just not much to say about it. I mean, you guys know this is this is quality. It's what it is. So that's it, guys. Plenty of footage with the Tabor um, on the conversion kit here. Uh, next, we will do the full review. Like I said, we've been shooting this thing for a year now, so we are ready to do it. But uh, you know, we didn't put a couple hundred rounds through it. There are thousands of rounds to this rifle no real issues whatsoever so that's pretty much it guys we'll see you guys in the next video